Good afternoon, Colorado. Welcome to a Friday edition of What's for Lunch. I'm your host, Larry Herz. Special edition today, I realized that I've got to step up my ethnic game. I'm just eating pizza and wings and burgers all the time. So I saw on Instagram these beautiful pictures of this Mexican seafood restaurant. And I'm going to butcher the name, but I'm going to give it a shot. Las Islas Marias. Close enough? Yes, sir. And Jesus here is the proprietor. Jesus, welcome. Hi. Hi, Larry. Give us a history of your restaurant. When did it start? Where did it start? Well, I'm third generation in this company. Um, it's a family franchise. And we started um, in, in California back in 82 in a food truck. Okay. And what we provide and the experience our restaurant has is basically what, you know, the locals and all the, you know, really good places, good recipes, where when you go to the beach and you eat all this fresh um, seafood, you know, we make our own house seasoning. And um, we stick with the recipes that, you know, my mom and her sisters-in-laws and my dad all, you know, um, know and love. Where, where exactly is this location? Um, the restaurant here? Yeah. In Colorado? The, yeah. It's in Aurora. It's in the corner of um, Peoria and Ilif. It's yep. in the plaza. It's called um, Ilif Plaza. And, um, yeah, you can find us there. La Ciudad Maria is ready to serve you. So I saw this on Instagram. I thought, oh, it's... This is a one restaurant that you know seems fairly new, and it turns out you have quite a few of them. Yes, sir. That's it. That's that's, that's right. How many you got? And we have a big family, so we have about sixty-five right now in the nation. Sixty-five of these. How many? Do you know how many states? Um, California. I'm gonna try and get a shot. California, Go for it. Washington. Um, um, what did I say? It's, uh, Nevada, Texas, Illinois, Georgia, Kentucky. Jeez. Um, that's pretty good right Ohio. there. Ohio. Yeah, we're going, we're, we're st there's a lot more places. But and and they're all owned by your family? Yes. Uh, first first cousins, aunts or uncles. Okay. Yeah, that's it. And, and the concept there is, is what? Like, is it, is this what we get? Is this what a plate looks like if I yes, went there? Yes, exactly. Very portionate. That's how they, like, um, my dad started it, my uncle started it. So, you know, you go, you eat well. It's not like a little bit, you know, you just, you get full. It's big enough plate okay and so when coronavirus happened uh did you guys have to shut down unfortunately we did have to shut down a few days uh -huh. we had to lay off um, just a couple of uh, the waiters because basically we were a big place and it was reduced to nothing we were just working on uh, delivery and uh, we opened up grubhub and uh, uber eats because we needed uh, the help and it was uh, it was pretty rough i mean i was working there myself tried to employ my cooks I grabbed some, um, the cooks and the preps and you know I told them to you know to keep working and we still paid them and we, you know it's everybody together so it yeah. was like a big family and I couldn't let anybody down so you know just you know just sure. stick it up what um, you've reopened for dining I, I assume am. and how's that going it's going great we um, we have the sanitizer in the front we have all the, the tables six feet apart we have the uh, the waiters uh, with the with the face mask and the uh, the plastic. Uh, wow! Thing. So yeah, I mean we're doing all the regulations and trying to stay above water and you know just try right. to keep going like nothing happened. And are you a reservation place? Yes, we are a reservation. You um, on the website on Lasilo Marias on Facebook. You can so given the website, oh, so it's not the website; it's the Facebook they they go yeah, to. Yeah, the the Facebook is bigger. The website is is um, in the in the Facebook. You could click on it. But you just have to call the number on the Facebook. It's Las Islas Marias. Um, that's how it is. Colorado, uh -huh. with the state at the end. Do you know the phone number? Um, not a happy. <laughs> Nobody knows their phone number. <laughs> we should have. We should have told you you were gonna need that. Yeah, on Google, I mean. Yeah. Well, I'm fired up. I mean, like I said, I, I I just have been eating just so much boring. Like everybody really during this time has been eating a lot of pizza, just because it's easy for takeout. And this looks like you know I, I go to Mexico all the time. Um, uh, and it looks like some authentic stuff. That there over there, the empanadas, we, uh, it's our own handmade dough at home. Okay. We put our own, a um, little bit of shrimp broth, we put a little bit of... Uh, cracker open for you guys. Yeah, there you yeah. go. See the shrimp inside? Yeah. So it's shrimp empanadas? Yes. Yes, sir. Normally I wait till the end to eat, but I'm going to take a little bite right now. And that's now. our homemade um, tartar sauce as well. So if I was in Mexico, this is what I get, right? What get, yes. Different than what we get in America, probably. All the experience you get in the beach, the seasoning, the um, authenticity, everything is there. 
They brought me, brought me three things three things to drink here. What, well, tell me what the drinks are. So here, this is our Mexican michelada, michelada but it has no beer. We just put um, soda water in there. And um, you can basically find all the ingredients except the alcohol in it. Still good. Yeah. And, and better this with beer, here, though. Um, right? Our uh, house-made, or cha uh, sorry, Jamaica is basically hiccup's water. We, um, we boil it, then we strain it, add a little bit of sugar, and a fresh drink. That's delightful. So it's, it's jicama juice. Yes. But where do you get the color? Um, it's natural. The jicama gives you that much color? Yes. I would not have known that. Yeah, this is, this is awesome. On a hot day yeah. outside? Yes, sir. Of course, I'd put some vodka in here, too. <laughs> <laughs> There's drinks. There's drinks over there, so. Yeah, you can mix. All right. And, and this, this is horchata. our house-made um, horchata. It's also made in, in the restaurant. It's uh, rice, a um, little bit of cinnamon, and um, condensed ah, milk. It's fantastic also. Sorry, I have three drinks today. Nothing for you, Josh. What? <laughs> All right, let's keep talking about food. What do we got next here? Here, this is our... Um, Basically, the the house one of the house specials. I brought you three things. House specials. This is the when you go and sit down to the restaurant, you just not um get chips, cracker, and salsa. You also get protein, which is um, fish ceviche. It's um it's cooked in lime juice, one hundred percent lime juice, no bottled, no artificial anything. Okay. We uh, we strain it, and we wash the uh, carrots so it wouldn't uh, on cold water so it wouldn't you know color everything um, orange. So you can still see the protein of the fish itself. And we just add the vegetables, a little bit of salt, and it's a fresh, um, you know, dish to start so off. It's not actually cooked, right? The lime juice cooks it? Yes, sir. Yeah. It's it's like a little entry as appetizer. So when people go in, they taste our sauce oh, and right. our fish. So you're saying everybody gets this? Everybody that goes inside the restaurant gets that as soon as they I didn't they catch that. Yeah. So this is like your version of chips and salsa, but they get... Actually, they ceviche. Fish, yes, you you sit down, That's you watch the menu, and as soon as you you tr like people, as soon as they try it, they're like, "Oh, look, another seafood place." They try that, they try the salsa, and they they know it's it's a hit, and they they, they think everything is is great. That's a heck of a deal. All right, now it looks like we got some prawns here. Yes, um, these are a house special uh, langostinos. This is what makes basically put us on the map in the United States and in everybody's homes. It's our Basically, 30-year recipe seasoning that we do in-house, and actually in my home, because we can't have nobody see it. Come so, on. Yeah. We, we do everything at home, and then we bring it to the restaurant. Amazing. So it is basically a kept secret, like the mm -hmm. grandma's secret. And yeah, I mean, that's basically what took off. We got a little, some oh. rice, some veggies, and what's Steamed the sauce? Steamed vegetables, um, serrano salsa, fresh, that has... Um, a little bit of cucumber, uh, cilantro, um, serrano peppers, um, salt, and 100% lime uh, lime juice squeezed inside. And then we just a little bit of blending in, and boom, that's it. You take the shrimp out, dip a little bit in there, okay. pop it in your mouth. I'll be doing that shortly. And then it has a garlic bread. Every single plate has a garlic bread on it too as well. Okay. And here, this is our basically our number one pasta, pasta marinera. You know, it has uh, mussels, octopus, and shrimp, and a little bit of presley all over, you know. And it's basically like our, our cream Alfredo pasta um, seafood. What are your uh, hours there? Do you do, do you brunch? I have a lunch special on Monday through Friday. What's that? What's... Um, basically is, um, I think the hours are from, from uh, nine, no, from, from 10 to three. Um, we have uh, our special menu. It's all nine ninety nine. Come on, nine ninety nine. Yeah. For stuff like this. Yeah, for stuff like this, it has a whole list of the, all the plates that we have on special. It's all Monday through Friday. Okay. And yeah, I mean. And then dinner is seven dinner, days or. Seven. Uh, we're open seven days a week from ten in the morning all the way till ten at night. Okay. And um, Friday and Saturday kitchen closes at eleven. All right. Just in case Let's, you. Uh, and full full bar. Full bar. Guessing you do pretty good margaritas. We have margaritas. I couldn't bring one yet, um, but we have a one that we um, we actually grabbed this idea from South Beach, and it's a uh, our margarita bull margarita. It has two Coronas and uh, five shots, and it's like huge bowl. Where where is that one? You know, I couldn't bring it. I you could have. The cooler had to be big, so I couldn't just. It was a huge <laughs> margarita. Next time. Yeah, next, next time. Next time you bring me that. It's like a foot and a half big. So. I'm going straight in for this. 
Yeah. Um, so give them, tell them how to get in touch with you again. Tell them what the Facebook page is. Um, our pages are Las Islas Marias Colorado on Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook. And yeah, I mean, we, you could check out the pages. We have videos, we have uh, pictures. Um, we also have sushi, Mexican cooked sushi. It's like our twist of everything cooked, nothing wrong in our, in our sushi. And um, yeah, we have a couple other things like, um, you know, steak and all that stuff. But, you know, just that's on the side if people don't really are in the mood of seafood. We also have okay. a, a little side menu or something else. Well, I appreciate you coming in. Go visit him down in Aurora. The address again is 12203 East Iliff Avenue in Aurora, Colorado, on the corner of Peoria and Iliff. Thanks, Jesus. We'll see you again Monday for more yummy eats on uh, What's for Lunch? Let's eat. That's crazy. You give that for free.